you guys and welcome to another episode of Not So Very Extended. So we are now officially living in the Lannister household. Uh, I went ahead and actually got us our own room that was already here and kind of, you know, changed it up a little bit enough to fit Onyx. So I did go ahead and take some photos with Jalen just so that Onyx can like look at their bedside table and you know remember Jalen because obviously they're not living together anymore and I love how in this photo you can actually still see the bite <laughs> that uh, Onyx gave him but we did move in here with Salem and Luna as well so they're basically gonna be living around this room most of the time fill these bowls for them so that they can eat and whatnot I'm kind of like I like the whole like moving as a bad thing, but when you're like not that far from the thing, like I kind of don't want you to be doing that. So maybe I'll change it back so that you're not. Okay, can you not fill that one? Wait, why? It's literally right here, hun. Like what's the problem? Please tell. Oh, there we go. It might have been because of the like thingies that were on the wall here. All right, anyways, so the first thing I want to go ahead and do, because last episode was so much went on. If you guys haven't seen last episode, definitely go check it out. But today we need to officially get into the education career so that we can start, you know, working from home because um, if you guys don't remember the uh, backstory for this gen, essentially since, you know, Onyx didn't finish their proper degree, the only thing that they could get a job in after, you know, they dropped out of university was becoming a Simlish um, online teacher. So that's exactly what we're going to be doing. Uh, so we're going to go into education and be a teacher for a little bit so we are starting off at oh we're at level three wait i didn't expect that i thought we we're gonna be starting from level one <laughs> i mean that's fine i guess um okay this is actually probably better for us then to get a jump start and accept the assignment yeah oh my god if we get promoted even sooner than i thought then that's gonna be interesting because I didn't expect that. We don't even start work for three days, so this gives us enough time to actually start writing. So what we have left to do for the challenge is write, uh, is Master Vampire lore skill, the pipe organ skill, of course, join the education career, get to level four, and then um, quit, uh, write and publish five books, complete the Master Vampire aspiration, as well as creating our own vampire family and turning at least two uh, sims, which I already made those two sims. If you guys didn't see the create a sim that I uploaded yesterday, those are going to be the two sims that are going to be turned by uh, Onyx. And then, of course, running our own business, which is probably going to happen a lot sooner because we are level three of the career. I probably would have changed the rules to make it so that we would be level five of the career. But I mean, I guess it's fine because like I don't expect this to be a career that uh, Onyx decides to stay in for too long. It's so weird actually living in a different place. I'm probably not going to be focusing much as far as taking care of uh, Elisa Veda and Kieran, we're just living in their household, so they're basically going to be taking care of themselves for the most part. Why are you sad, though? Oh, eternal sadness. That's why she's sad. Oh, honey. This part of the challenge is going to be more so grindier than anything, which is why I think that I'll be able to wrap this series up a lot sooner than I thought, because... I mean, most of the stuff that we're going to be doing here is going to be, you know, focused around, you know, leveling skills, which we haven't really been doing much of, except for, like, at the beginning of Onyx's generation, uh, which we only had bowling skills, so we haven't been able to really focus on that prior, which, I mean, is okay, because, like, it's the way I wrote out the challenge, and I didn't want to... Because it'd be weird if, like, Onyx was working on pipe organ skill when they have nothing in relation to vampires or, like, learning anything about them, you know? It'd be really weird. So, the only thing now I'm thinking about... Oh, we already have level three of research and debate skill. When did that happen? Oh, because you were in university. Wait, oh my god. I'm actually kind of smart for doing that. Because <laughs> since they were in uni and doing homework for these classes and going to those classes, they were learning that skill. Oh my god. I really did that without even thinking about it. Okay, we are thirsty, so we do have our wonderful plasma packs that we can actually drink from. Um, I don't know if we're going to be going out and, like, hunting for Sims. Uh, I do want to, like, head out over to, like, this bar and stuff and, like, see, you know, what's up and whatnot. And we also have, like, this park over here as well that we can go and hang out in, uh, which we might go to later. Hopefully these guys will, like, take care of themselves for the most part because I don't want to have to do too much when it comes to them. Like, obviously I'll, like, help them out if they need it, but other than that, like, you need some... You need some help as well. But I, what I want to do is actually do some vampire sparring because we have to defeat three vampires in combat. Now, I'm sure that we probably won't be able to because Elisa Veda and Kieran are both 
a lot stronger than us. So the one thing that I want to try and work towards getting is the vampire strength. I feel kind of bad that I like left Jalen alone without like the cats or anything. I was thinking about splitting the cats and like having him have one of them. But I was just like, these are Onyx's cats. So I didn't want to just like leave one behind because I love them, you know? So later on, we're going to go ahead and find our first victim that we're going to be turning because I think that since we are a minor vampire and we, we've learned vampire creation, I think it makes sense for Onyx to go that extra mile and actually turn somebody. And we finished writing our first book. Okay, well, what we're going to do, I don't think I can publish it just yet. Can I? Okay, no, I can't publish it yet. Wait, is this the book that we just wrote? Okay, it is the book that we wrote. We might try and reach level f seven of vampire lore so we can get that out of the way. So we might, actually, do I, I don't think the tomes came with me, did they? Mm, no. Okay, we're gonna have to purchase the tome again, which is okay. We'll just buy it and then read it. And then after this, I'm gonna try and have them spar with, I wanna, I think I should go for Kieran because Unless I can only spar with Elisa Vetta, I don't know. Can I spar with you? Have a magical first kiss in the air. Oh my god, <laughs> why should I do that? How do you spar? Okay, we're level 7. Sweet. Oh, maybe I can spar with Kieran. I just have to do it through here. Friendly. Okay, let's go try and spar. He's probably gonna still win because he's still stronger than us. So, we can try. Oh no, this is a bad idea to do it outside in the sun though. Okay, maybe if it's quick. Oh gosh. I have to keep an eye out on this because this is going down. Ooh! And by keep an eye out, I mean keep an eye out on this because what the heck? Oh, we're losing. We're so... Oh, maybe not? Please. We won? We won! Okay, go inside. Go inside, guys. Quick, quick, quick. My hair's a bat. Go here, go here, go here. Okay, well, we won our first battle. Sheesh. What does this say? Oh, wait, was that attractive that we won? A breathtaking encounter from seeing an attractive Centurion's eyes were caressed by a truly magnificent sight as a particularly appealing sim just entered his view. This fine specimen of a sim now has Kirid's undivided attention as they try to pick their jaw up from the floor. There are heart-pounding moments, but this one here is heart-stopping. Dang! Productive duel, good sparring session. Even immortal vampires need to practice all the sweet moves if the plan is being the one. Alright, look at Onyx winning though! I'm so proud of you. Maybe this would be the moment that they would have like a romantic kiss. Oh, I don't know how to feel about this, but here we go. Oh my God, wait, that is so cute. <laughs> what the hell? Wait, I love that. That's the Passionate Romance mod, by the way, by Sacrificial. I haven't had it in my game for a minute, but they've added so much new stuff to it, and that is one of them, so... Oh, that was so cute! Magical kiss from being passionate. Onyx just had a kiss so magical that it fell out of this world. Oh my god. That is so everything. Alright. I think you need to go ahead and do some... I do really want to try and, like, level up onyx's vampire level as quick as possible because i would like for them to be up there vampire secrets I, i'm gonna just have you research quite a bit okay let's keep researching i think there is a point where you just can't learn anymore from computers i think i also need to remember to do our assignment for work as well welcome wagon honey we live here oh i guess because we're new but you're also very new. Oh wait, this is actually kind of good. Oh wait, I never changed these outfits for them. So the, this is Dimitri and Lana. Wait, this is so perfect. He's meeting Lana. Oh my God, Kieran. Wait, this is actually really good. Um, let's do Alluring Visage. Vampire Alluring Visage. Okay. Oh, this is so good that we're meeting them. Invite neighbors in. Hey, guys. And look, it's Maximus. We're neighbors now, our bestie. So Lana's attracted to Kieran now, which is perfect because that's exactly what we need. So we can just be romantic with her. 
Oh, we should also come here and meet everybody, okay? So, um, be friendly. Great new neighbor. Maybe they were, like, interested in coming and, and meeting us as well. Because they're new to the neighborhood, too. They just moved here. The same exact time as Onyx. That works out. Pick up line. Thanks for coming. Go say hey to Lana. Hey, girly. She's so freaking pretty. I love her. Oh, wait, you're... <laughs> All right, Onyx is under um, his spell as well. <laughs> right, right. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh no. This is so awkward because now, <laughs> now Onyx is feeling a little jealous because Kieran is flirting with Lana, but... Shoo! Okay. Oh no. Drifting love from jealousy. Well, honey, this is how it is, so I don't know what to tell you. We need to go meet Dimitri as well. Oh, there he is. Go say hey. Greet new neighbor. And then we let's also meet greet Lilith too, because we've never met her, actually. Maybe because of like Onyx getting hurt by Kieran flirting with Lana. Maybe to like Kind of like curse Lana, that's when we like turn her or something, you know? Now you'll be a vampire like us forever. <laughs> Thanks for coming. You're so good looking. Like, ah, oh, I love them. I'm sorry. I was just like really proud of how she turned out. Like, she's just very adorable. So, Kieran did his magic. Like, she's already in love here. Like, she loves it here. So, I think that what we could probably do is take her upstairs, you know, like maybe like show her around the house and by show her on the house, we can go ahead and bite that neck. So why don't we go ahead and add her to a group and let's just go over to our bedroom and just hang out and chat, you know, just get to know each other. All right, just come on, come on through Lana. You're so pretty. Oh, are you attracted to us too? Dang, I know. We're looking so good today as well. I want to get to know her a little bit um, so that we don't like fully like just bite into her neck without getting to know her. Although I feel like Onyx might do that because they're a little hurt. <laughs> but it's just Kieran's game, I guess you could say. So um, can I even turn her yet? Complain about sunlight, complain about problems. Yeah, let's just complain to her. Let's see. Oh, not her being like, oh. Okay. Can I not turn her? Oh, turn into a vampire. Here we go. Wait, I wonder if we can detect her personality and if like we can actually learn about her. Oh, oh you're doing it. Yes. Okay, so we've learned that she's self-absorbed, non-committal, and romantic. No, 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 girl, come back here. Come, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh. ah. Come back here, Miss Thing. Where do you think you're going? Hey, Maximus, it's so good to see you again. I'm gonna go ahead and just turn you into a vampire. No big deal. Yes. Come through, Onyx. Ooh. There we go. Get that girl. Yeah, relax. Ooh, she looks good with the bite on her neck. Hell yeah. Okay. Lana Pearson has consumed the essence of a vampire and will turn in a few days time. Yeah, you will. <laughs> okay, so we've used up quite a bit of power there. I just noticed. So we're gonna need to um, relax. I wonder if I can drink from her since she is here. Let me see. We should probably go welcome again. Thank you. Can I drink from her? Oh, I can still drink plasma. Okay, I'm gonna compel her for a deep drink before she like turns so that we can actually, you know, get a taste for her blood, okay? Oh, I love being a vampire in this game. Not gonna lie. Probably one of the best occults. Sorry, you know, spellcasters and mermaids and aliens, but it is what it is. Poor Lana, but girl, you're about to be a vampire just like us and then you're gonna move in. <laughs> Can't wait for us to have a nice little household of vampires. Yes! You'll be fine. You'll wake up and you'll feel better. I promise. Well, maybe. I don't know. Anyways, Kira must be very proud of us because we just turned somebody... I wish you could, like, 
brag about it or something like hey like we just turned our first sim <laughs> but i don't think we can i wonder if we can go ahead and try and spar with elisa Vetta and see if we can maybe potentially defeat her but i doubt we will be able to because she is a master vampire so it might be a little harder but it doesn't hurt to try Let's go ahead and give it a go. Oh wait, you're, you're, no, I'm just kidding. I'm totally joking. I forgot your energy. You can't do that. Yeah, go sleep. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. My God, it's summertime and like the sun here looks so good. Look at how the lighting looks here. <gasps> that looks so nice. Oh my God. Ooh, it's so red. Okay, sunset come through. Wow. Looks so nice here. Anyways. Oh, we're also going through a heat wave, so that makes sense. Probably the worst time to be a vampire. <laughs> oh, that's what you look like crying. Aww. Something's very wrong here, but... <laughs> hey, guys! How's it going? Give them some love and attention. It feels weird not having Jalen around, though. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> You get so used to it and then here we are we'll shower um and then oh <gasps> wait you came over wait she came over just so we could witness her death shut up come here what what are you doing here uh sienna honey your mom just died oh uh... I didn't know you were even here. Where's Sienna? <laughs> that was so random. Like, who the heck is dying? Oh, at least you look good. I'm gonna miss you. That means Gen 12 is officially gone. Gen 12, my baby. It's okay, Onyx. Wow, so much loss for Onyx. Like, they just lost their mom and they're very, like, actual loving romantic relationship and wow i guess this this lot is fitting for santa to die on actually because it is a haunted lot so i'm gonna keep her urn here so that you know she can come and haunt it whenever you whenever she pleases okay we love you sienna <laughs> that's so random that she like was here though okay go ahead and shower and then um, I'm going to try and have you spar with Elisa Vetta. Oh, I feel so bad. A friend has passed. More like your mother. Excuse me? A friend. Oh, you poor thing. I guess what we can do to get your fun up is read. And since we have the vampire tone, we might as well. Hey, Kieran. Are you listening to the spooky station? What are you listening to? Strange tunes. And you're really vibing with this, Kieran? Nice. I am not, though. So I'm gonna change the station. <laughs> oh, we just leveled up to level eight. Eight? Wait, we discovered new plants. The thing is about vampires is like, because they don't actually really need to sleep that much, like time goes by so differently for me. <laughs> Here we go. Come on, Onyx. We gotta win another one. We did really well the last time. Come on. You got it? <gasps> no! She got us. She's like, honey, you have to practice. <laughs> Maybe we can ask her for training. Onyx needs to be in a better emotional state to do this. Oh, really? That impacts that? Oh, well, well. Let me, I hate writing letters of recommendation because it takes so long to do. I'm about to just not do that one and just wait for another career <laughs> or for another assignment. But no, I'm going to go ahead and do it. It's just that one takes the longest. I'd rather just not. I should have just said no to the work from home assignment. Okay, we finished our letter recommendation. We have that done and we got paid. But another thing that I want to try and do a little bit of is playing the um pipe organs i'm gonna have them just come over here and practice for a little while maybe they can you know 
put in their sadness into a piece of music or something like that. We wrote a book today. Wait, can you learn stuff from these headphones? I think somebody did like a mod or something where you can like listen to podcasts or something like that where it actually lets you learn skills. I don't know if I'm imagining that or if that actually is a thing. I feel like I've seen something like that before. But I think once we become a master vampire, I think that's when we're gonna like properly reconnect with Jalen a little bit because I feel like at that point they'll have a better hold on, you know, their powers and, you know, how to handle their strength and all that stuff. So I think that's what we're gonna do it. And then once we hit prime vampire, I think that's when we'll turn Dimitri into a vampire as well. So we're not like turning them all at the same time. So my goal would be to try and get Onyx to prime vampire today. Um, so we'll see if I can get that done. Let me actually purchase one of these vampiric strengths. Jalen's calling us. I, I hear you're not too good at haggling. Why don't you let me take you to the flea market and show you how a pro gets a great price? Oh, I would love to go, but honestly, it's not really a good idea because we're going to be out in the sun. So I'm going to have to cancel on you. Oh, Jalen, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'd love to, though. I'll write a sad book. Wait, that's actually perfect. Go do that. Who's calling us? <gasps> Lana, do you wanna go out on a date? Oh, shoot. Bro, you can come over here. <laughs> Invite over Lana. Oh, Jalen, I'd love to hang out, but no, 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 no. I'm sorry. We're just not ready for that yet. Wait, is Lana here? Oh, she is here. Hey, girly. All right, we finished writing another book. That's two out of five. We still have it to publish them, but Obviously, we will end up at some point. Can I still drink from you? Let me see if I can. I still can't. Okay, I'm just gonna do it. Thank you for bringing Lana over so that we can, you know, feed. <laughs> How is your thirst already going up without us even biting into her neck yet? Oh, well, okay. This is gonna chill on our floor for a little bit. I know you're a guilty drinker, but it's okay. Sanguinary satisfaction. The plasma really hit the spot. That's what I'm saying. That's fresh. It's darker outside now. I think we should be fine and we should be able to spar with Kieran now. So let's go ahead and do that. Hopefully, since we are stronger now, that we'll be able to beat him. <gasps> Jalen's here! That's how much he misses us. Wow. Okay, Onyx. Get him, come on. Not him being like, yeah, you can punch me all you want, but you won't get me. <laughs> this is really awkward. We got him! Uh, wow, and you call yourself a vampire? <laughs> Kinda lame. Should we say hey to Jalen since he is here? Go interact with him just very briefly. <laughs> oh, see, th that's what I like, you know? They just, you know, said hey, and then that was it. And then he left. Did I say weft? Yeah, he left. He left, sorry. <gasps> you know what we should do is light the fireplace and have you sit right here. Light it and then sit right there and read. That's gonna be a mood. There we go. Perfect. Okay, we're level nine and we discovered plasma fruit recipes. So they can now prepare a plasma fruit salad and the plasma Jane drink. Wait, that's actually good. What if we did a restaurant and that's like the only thing we served was the plasma stuff for it like be a vampire restaurant. That's actually not a bad idea. Now I think about it, we're super close to being prime. <gasps> Here we go, we're prime vampire. Now he's gonna defeat a vampire one more time and then we'll, we're will we done with that part of the aspiration. <gasps> Child of the moon, I think I wanna do this one. Although the manipulate life spirit seems interesting. It says gain power to drain life spirit from other sims or restore life spirit from those who have been drained. Does that mean you can bring Sims back to life or no? I wonder what that means. Cause it says also enables Onyx to protect the ones he loves or simply refresh his prey using restore life spirit. Maybe I'll try and get that later. Cause I'm interested. I think for this one, I'll do withered stomach because the chance of us eating human food is probably so rare. You might not even have to worry about it. So I'm just gonna get this one. Today we start our first day of work, which I mean by our first day of work, we're literally working from home. So, you know, we're not going anywhere because we can't really go to work for what we're doing. Oh, we can spar again. All right, let's do it one more time and see if we can complete this. You're already preparing? Nah, this is unfair. We didn't even work out. 
No! He got us instead this time! Erin, you weren't supposed to. Oh my god, your face. You good? Of course, the last time we need to win, it doesn't work. Yeah, you best help me up. Jesus. Good fight, good fight. I don't know if we can go again or not, can we? Oh, we can go again. All right. Again, again, before the sun comes out. Yes, Onyx. Okay, can you explain to me how we are holding him by the neck like this? Our hands should be around his neck, not like holding him by his invisible neck. You know what I'm saying? Hell yeah. We did that. All right. Well, uh, that part of the aspiration is done. <laughs> so now we gotta do is read the ultimate vampire tome, become a grandmaster vampire, and survive for an additional 20 days as a vampire. So, 20 days. <laughs> Shouldn't be that bad, I don't think. Uh, I think that's the last part of the aspiration, am I correct? Yeah. 20 days. Well, that's a lot longer than I thought, <laughs> that I think about it. Oh, but I got this, I got this. I mean, I have a lot of skill grinding to do and all that, so... We'll probably end up, you know, playing these 20 days, maybe. So we need to finish reading the second tome in order to buy the third, and then the third, okay. So we still have some catching up to do as far as that. All right, officially getting our call for work. So uh, we're gonna be working from home exclusively. So what we gotta do is create a lesson plan. That should be easy. After we read our book, of course. Wait, we have to create a lesson plan and a letter of recommendation? They're putting us to work. Actually, no, don't we publish books by the mailbox? Oh, self-published, that's right. Wait, he's an engineer as well. <gasps> oh, you know what probably happened? is when I copied Kieran, Jalen. He got the same job as Kieran. Well, actually, maybe they just meet at work. I think I'm gonna have him meet coworkers when he goes to work. And that way, it'll be like, kind of easing into that relationship is like, you know, finding out that, you know, wow, like you guys, it's like looking in a mirror, you know? All right, we wrote our third book. So why don't you come over here and publish these? There we go. The most recent book that Onyx wrote has been nominated for an award. Check out the next award ceremony Sunday at 7 p.m. to see if they won. Wait, we should go. Cause I'd be kind of sick if we did win. I might hit up Lana to see if she's turned or not because I'm not entirely sure if it's been, oh no, I don't think it's been three days yet. Has it? Oh, Kieran met Jalen at work. Oh my God. Is this the start of something new? <laughs> it feels so right being here with you. Mm -hmm. Oh, we're almost pipe organ level three? Okay, we're definitely leveling, leveling that today as well. Oh, doing the letter recommendation and like lesson plans, I think that levels up research and debate because it looks like that's the skill it's working. I didn't even realize. Okay. We finished doing all our work, so their fun is low now. So I think reading up on the vampire tome will be what we need to do. So go ahead and read that. We also need to finish it. So the sooner we finish it, the better. And why don't we go invite Lana over so we can check up on her. This skill, look, that is, there is no way, level 10. <gasps> she's turning! Hold on, let's make this epic in your cute outfit. Oh my gosh, she's gonna have such an ugly outfit. I can already feel when she turns. It's your time. Yes! Oh my god! Let's not. Let's never change, okay? Never wear that again, please. Okay, since I'm gonna add her to the family now, so she's gonna live here, okay? Don't ever wear that outfit again. All right, welcome to the family, Lana. It's good to see you. Oh my God. All right, well, we're level 10 of vampire lore. Um, I think we're still five skills away from maxing it, but I wanna, I wanna finish reading this book. Keep reading, please. Okay, why are you... Did you use a learning visage on her? Okay, we learned everything from that book. Perfect, so now we can buy the third one. Oh, do you wanna hang out tonight? Oh my God, I'd love to. I promise we're trying to get to Master Vampire as soon as possible, okay? Okay. Ooh, here we go. Romance. Compliment appearance. He's clearly attracted to her. Confess attraction. Look at that. Ooh. Oh, they are so cute. 
He wants to woohoo. First kiss? Let's go for it. Might as well. Yes! It's kind of- I feel like it's kind of fitting for vampires as well to have that. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> what is going on with you? Stuffed up? Oh my- Oh my- Elisa! We gotta get you some medicine, hun. Oh my god, we gotta get you some medicine. Stat. Oh, you wanna chat with us? Yes. Let's be besties. Show off powers. Yeah. Let's show her. Yeah, you'll get there too. We're just better than you. <laughs> <laughs> we can offer training to her. Yes, let's do that. Since you're our offspring, we gotta teach you. Onyx has grown up as a vampire now. And now they're doing the teaching. Oh, well, that didn't work. <laughs> it's okay. We're still learning. <laughs> Oh, she's impressed by us. Hell yeah. I think I'd like to finish writing two more books so we can have that out of the way. Hey, level three. We can play theme songs. I wonder what theme songs. Ooh, theme. The Vampire Slayer. This is a Vampire Slayer song? Interesting. I would have thought it'd be something more dramatic and like intense. Oh, are you appreciating her playing? That's so cute. I love her. I haven't seen Vampire Woohoo in, in a minute. Oh, you guys enjoy that. Oh, the moms are out. <laughs> oh, hey guys. <laughs> oh, y'all are sweaty. That's gross. Y'all need showers. We can now craft. The Sunlight Reversal Cocktail on the bar. All right, level 12. We also learned the Vampire Resistance Cocktail. Okay, Onyx, we're working from home. Okay, so we didn't get promoted, which I guess is good. So we're not going through it way too quickly. <laughs> okay, level 13. And we unlocked, I think, the final tome, which is a thousand simoleons. I mean, it's worth it, right? Okay, we're level 14. We have one more. We discovered Drought, drought of con Reconfiguration. Oh, it's a drink that lets vampires re reset all their powers. Wait, we finished reading it? But I kind of want to get just reach level 15 at this point. We're already so close. We might as well wrap it up. Oh, Jalen? What are you doing in here? Oh, no. You probably shouldn't be here. Flirty. Oh, no. They can't stay apart. Oh, my God. Hey, how'd you get in? Oh, he has a residence key, that's why. Oh god, no. We should probably send you home though. Just because, you know, for your own safety. I mean, I guess we can talk for a little bit, you know? We're getting stronger, we're getting better at uh, being a vampire, so we're learning. Yeah, this is, this is a good distance, I think. We're not getting sucked into Kieran's uh, love as much anymore. Like, we're standing our own ground at this point. But I'm gonna send him home because we're starting to hit that thirst mark. So, using a research archive machine to research any topic. Listen, does it look like I have an archive machine here? No. Not our computer breaking while we're writing our letter of recommendation. I don't need to start over, right? I hope not. I'm gonna be so upset if I have to. Maybe this means we do actually have to go to the library. Let's just do it. <laughs> we'll just hire a repair service and go to the library. Maybe let's just try and level up this skill first before we go. And we are done. Yes. Oh, there is a vampire cure. That's right. Onyx has learned that ultimate vampire secret, how to cure vampirism. They can now make the ultimate vampire cure at the bar. Um, there is nothing else for Onyx to learn about vampires. Dang, we know everything. Look at us. I think another thing I would like to try and accomplish this episode is, um, well, writing two more books and then publishing them so that we can be done with that as well. But we have to go back. We have to go to the library to go do our work. Okay. We got to get inside quick. I don't know why they don't open their an umbrella. Do I have to have one of those umbrella stands? I wonder why Kieran does it automatically, but we don't. Hopefully we can kick somebody off the computer and finish writing our recommendation letter. That is if we don't have to start over. But if I do, I'm not gonna be happy. <laughs> no. 
Am I writing it from scratch? No, Jalen, sorry. We are writing it from scratch. Are you kidding me? Okay, well, it is what it is. Just keep writing. I also need to be mindful that if I do actually want to turn Jalen into a vampire, that I do it before he turns into a an adult, which I don't think he's there yet. Oh, he's already an adult. Wait, what? He must have aged up recently then. I promise we'll get you soon. Maybe we can at least write one more book before I wrap up today. Book number four, published. Nice. Are you flirting with her? Oh, she's delirious because she's sick again. Oh, hen. Maybe just write one more book and just wrap that up in this episode. <laughs> Honestly, let's do it. Oh no, we didn't get promoted. No, I thought maybe. Okay, so all we have to do is, again, conduct research and ask to volunteer. So, dang, I really thought we were gonna get promoted so quick. That's okay though. You know what would be perfect now that I think about it? Since we got nominated for an award for our book and we have an award show on Sunday, if we were to become a master vampire by then, we could potentially go to the award show with Jalen because I feel like Onyx would have, would if anybody, would take them. You know what I mean? Wait, why can't we resume writing? Onyx needs to unlock their inner writer to do this. Go find something fun to do. Oh, then read a book, hun. <laughs> Wait, why are you tense? Oh, writer's block. Really? Really? Here, take take a nice bubble bath then. Of course you're getting a writer's block when I'm trying to wrap this up. Okay, we don't even make that much from royalties. Literally, what was that? 67 simoleons? All right, we finished our last book. Nice. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and have Onyx publish this to a publisher. We're famous? Well, they best be paying me a lot of money for these books then because honey, we're a celebrity now but i think this is a good point to wrap this episode off on next episode i'll hopefully be able to you know get onyx up in the vampire skill we can get back with Jalen loki and you know kind of build that back up and all that stuff so with that being said i'm gonna head out thank you guys so much for watching hope you guys enjoyed if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already and i'll talk to you guys in a new video very soon bye guys